What is graphic design? Graphic design is the art of communication, stylizing and problem solving through the use of type, space and image. The field is considered a subset of visual communication and communication design. But sometimes the term graphic design is used interchangeably with this due to overlapping skills involved. Graphic designers use various methods to create and combine words, symbols and images to create a visual representation of ideas and messages. A graphic designer may use a combination of typography, visual arts and page layout techniques to produce a final result. Graphic design often refers to both the process designing by which the communication is created and the products designs which are generated. Graphic design is a creative process that combines art and technology to communicate ideas. The designer works with a variety of communication tools in order to convey a message from a client to a particular audience. The main tools are image and typography. Common uses of graphic design include identity, logos and branding, publications, magazines, newspapers and books. Print advertisements, posters, billboards, website graphics and elements, signs and product packaging. For example, a product package might include a logo or other artwork, organized text and few design elements such as images, shapes and color which unify the piece. Composition is one of the most important features of graphic design, especially when using pre-existing materials or diverse elements. Graphic design uses the elements and principles of design to achieve communication objectives and stabbing suggests that this represent a type of visual grammar, effective application of the elements and principles of design ensure that graphic design can achieve a high signal to noise ratio in the visually cluttered 21st century. Image based design Designers develop images to represent the ideas their clients want to communicate. Images can be incredibly powerful and compelling tools of communication conveying not only information but also moods and emotions. People respond to images instinctively based on their personalities, associations and previous experience. For example, you know that a chili paper is hot and this knowledge in combination with the image creates a visual pun. Type-based design In some cases, designers rely on words to convey a message, but they use words differently from the ways writers do. To designers, what the words look like is as important as their meaning. The visual forms were the typography communication designed by means of the printed word or handmade lettering perform many communication functions. They can arrest your attention on a poster, identify the product name on a package or a truck, and present running text as the typography in a book does. Designers are experts at presenting information in a visual form in print or on film, packaging or signs.
image and type. Designers often combine images and typography to communicate a client's message to an audience. They explore the creative possibilities presented by words, typography, and images, photography, illustration, and fine art. It is up to the designer not only to find or create appropriate letter forms and images, but also to establish the best balance between them. Symbols, Logos, and Logotypes Symbols and logos are special, highly condensed information forms or identifiers. Symbols are abstract representation of a particular idea or identity. The CBSI and the active television are symbolic forms which you will learn to recognize as representing a particular concept or company. Logotypes are corporate identifications based on a special typographical word treatment. Some identifiers are hybrid or combinations of symbol and logotype. In order to create these identifiers, the designer must have a clear vision of the corporation or idea to be represented and of the audience to which the message is directed.